Hi, I'm Belly Dance with Talia. Today we're going to learn an upward figure eight. You're going to start by making sure your weight is even in both feet. Your knees are bent and you tuck the hips so it's like you zip up your pants and hold it there. The tailbone is straight down towards the floor. You're going to lift the rib cage up and away. We're going to move the knees back and forth, and as you do this, you notice that the hips will move up and down with them. Okay. Now, we bend the knees. We're going to bend the right knee even more so it falls down towards the floor. So you notice my hip line just got crooked. You're going to push out on the right side, and then straighten the knee so the hip comes up. You do the same thing on the left side. You're going to bend. Push out and then straighten the knee so you come back to center. Bend, push out, straighten, bend, push out, and straighten. Bend the right, push out, and straighten. Bend the left, push out, and straighten. So you're drawing a figure eight on the wall in front of you. Your right hip does the right loop, and your left hip does the left loop. Now we're going to add them together fluidly. So you have bend, out, straighten, 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 bend, out, straighten. So imagine that you're squished in between two walls. So you cannot twist the body at all. It's all straight up and down. So you see the knees are really working. My feet do not come up off the floor at all. And my upper body is just relaxed. It's bend out, straighten, bend out, straighten, bend out, straighten, bend out, straighten. So you imagine like it's a snake movement, but without the upper body, just the bottom half. Let's try it with some music. So five, six, seven, eight. And if you have any questions, feel free to email me at Talia, T-A-L-I-A, me, dance, at yahoo.com. Don't forget to push the like button and to leave a comment at the bottom.